Hey baddies! Welcome back to my channel. I am so happy that you're here. I am in desperate need of a self-care day and I haven't had one in a fat minute. We are going to go get our nails done because they look like this. They do not look good right now, so we're getting our hands done. We're also getting our little tootsies done. After that, we're going to do some self-care at home. I hope that you are all excited to spend the day with me. Let's get this self-care day going. I really need it. Let's just say that. Hey cuties! I wanted to show you all my hair care and what I do before I shower. So first, I use this 99% scalp care. This is from D Feel. As you can see, I'm like right at the bottom because this is what I use for my scalp, period. This has a cooling therapeutic blend of tea tree, castor, and olive oil. It's supposed to nourish and protect the hair and scalp and fight an itchy dry scalp. And then I like to go in with this rosemary oil from... Camille Rose. This is a new rosemary oil that I'm trying. I normally use the Miel rosemary oil. I have like literally a drop left of this. Since this is ending, I'm going to be using this on the ends of my hair to help with breakage and I'm also going to be putting a little bit on my scalp as well to help with hair growth. The last oil that I use is also from Camille Rose. This is the Rejuva Drops Comeback Oil. It has castor oil, peppermint oil, and saw, saw palmetto. Whew. This is actually for hair loss and alopecia. I decided I was going to buy it because whenever I do my slick backs, you can see my scalp. I'm not losing hair in any way, shape, or form. I just don't have as thick of hair on the side of my head as I do on the rest of my head. Let's go ahead and oil up our hair, and then I'm going to show you all the products that I use in the shower. So now that the oils are all in my hair, I'm going to go ahead and brush it through. This is a bamboo brush that I got from Sugar Bear Hair. It is done. I just put it up and I let it sit in a little clip until it is time to shower. I wanted to show you all what I use for shampoo and conditioner. I feel like the shampoo and conditioner is a game changer, at least for me and my hair type. And I obviously got to share with y'all. I use this Wella shampoo and conditioner. This is Wella Professional. It is a deep nourishing shampoo and a deep nourishing conditioner. So it nourishes dry or stressed hair, leaving in full vitality with nutrient-rich complex. I also let my conditioner sit for at least 10 minutes when I'm in the shower. I wanted to show you what I use for shampoo and conditioner. And then once my shower is over, then we're going to go into the skincare and do a little self-care night. wash my face using my Vani cream face wash and now I'm going in with the Dr. Dennis Gross exfoliating pads. The first one is meant to exfoliate and smooth. The second one is a anti-aging neutralizer. And I only exfoliate my skin about once a week. So two minutes is up. Now we're going to go in with number two. Now that we finished exfoliating our skin, I like to go in with this Innisfree face sheet. It is their aloe vera face sheet. It is a Korean skincare brand and I've been using these for a very long time. Never broken me out. They don't do me dirty at all. My forehead first. And you're gonna look scary. That's the point. <laughs> I could have put this on better. It's fine. So I'm gonna let this sit on my skin for about 10 to 15 minutes. Honestly, probably until it dries out. So, I will see you all in about 
10 minutes. Ooh. I let this soak into the skin and then after everything is dry, I go in and I do the rest of my skincare. Next, I use this Grande Lash MD Lash Serum. Now that that has dried down, my nighttime routine is very simple and easy. I go in with this Avani Cream Moisturizer. I've been using this for a very long time and it works so well. And I also go in with this Mad Hippie Antioxidant Face Oil. So I just mix these two together. That way I can get as much moisture as possible while I sleep. Alright, that is the skincare for tonight. I love how glowy and moisturized and hydrated my skin feels before I go to bed. I feel like it's the perfect combination because I wake up with such subtle hydrated skin and I love it every single time. I almost forgot, I do go in with this Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask, but I use this in the morning and at night. Okay, so I decided to straighten my hair as well, but that is it for the video. I hope that you all enjoyed this. We also have so many more subscribers than we did in our last video. I had like 70 people on my channel and now we're at like 292. <laughs> that is fantastic. That is amazing. I'm so happy that you are all here and that you are enjoying my content because this content is for you. It's for us. We are creating a community. So I'm so happy that you're here, and if you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and subscribe, and if you like the video, don't forget to like the video, and I will see you all in my next one. Bye!